The oceans, 1.3 billion cubic kilometres, cover most of our planet. Its mass is very much larger than the atmosphere, and that makes it the biggest reservoir of heat in the climate system. The energy that would raise the temperature of the atmosphere by 4 degrees Celsius would only raise the ocean temperature by a thousandth of a degree, barely detectable. Measuring changes in the ocean heat content are at the limits of our capability and made with much uncertainty and unknowns. Ocean temperatures have been made using many methods since they began in the 19th century, but only with the fairly recent introduction of the Argo array of automatic submersible buoys has there been any convincing estimates of errors and, with nearly 4,000 floats, adequate coverage of the oceans. Attempts to splice the Argo data to previous data sets are problematic. Despite struggling with inadequate data and often underappreciating uncertainties, it is likely that ocean heat content has increased in recent decades, although this is not a highly robust conclusion. For example, one paper published in 2019 claimed ocean heat content was accelerating, but when research upon which that conclusion was based was withdrawn due to underestimation of errors, the evidence for recent ocean heat increase became poor. It is difficult also to put recent changes into a proper historical context due to ambiguity about past ocean temperatures and uncertainties in the long-term oceanic temperature cycles and the transport of heat from surface layers to the deep ocean. It does seem, though, that the ocean heat content was somewhat greater earlier in the Holocene. Only certain regions of the ocean have warmed, in particular a region in the South Pacific, an observation based on good measurements, but which is not widely known. Understanding changes in the ocean system is vital for our understanding of the climate system. Progress is being made, but major uncertainties exist. Indeed, a survey of current research shows that there is no real understanding of the differences between real and systematic errors in the data from the dark ocean depths.